my beloved love. So a lot of you have been pointing out, or a lot of things have been illuminated and highlighted in your lives in order to bring them to the surface, because you are the person that has the skills to remove them or to raise the energy. So at this time, your guides want you to not doubt your power, to begin to see yourself as you truly are. More importantly, to see yourself as God sees you, because the innermost parts of yourself, divine feminine, are really beginning to shine. You're no longer going to be able to operate from this place of not really understanding who you are. That's a thing of the past. You have absolutely ascended to another timeline. And this full moon in Libra energy is literally all about you going within and deciding who gets to come with you, who gets to share this love that you have in your heart, who gets to be a part of this new and improved version of yourself. Who's worthy of that? Because relationships are literally the core of life. They can make you or they can break you. They can elevate you or they can crush you. Being attached to the wrong type of energy can literally trick you out of your destiny and can absolutely be a distraction. And so at this time, your guides want to make sure that you are surrounded by love, that you have people that speak life into you, that when you walk into the room, their eyes light up that pour into you. You're absolutely stepping into reciprocity because you've endured so much. You have been tested time after time, after time, after time, and every single time. It's almost as if your spiritual ability, your intuition, has been sharpened because you've seen so much. None of what you have been through is in vain at all. And the more that you begin to align with this energy and to be able to look at things from an observer position, not being emotionally attached, not placing judgment, not lingering onto the hurt, to the pain, understanding energy, and how it works. This is really your power. This is really your playground. This is really where you get to create magic. So, as we're still under this beautiful, powerful energy of this full moon in Libra, your guides really want you to Take some time to just assess who you are today and to also look around you at the people that are in close proximity to you, to understand who they are, to look at their journeys. Because in life, God will literally take each person down different roads, different detours. They'll have to encounter different people, places, and things in order to become who they're destined to be. So if you look around you, and you feel that this energy is being reciprocated, it's absolutely necessary for you to have this type of love in your life, for you to have these types of connections in your life. But if you don't see that, it's absolutely okay for you to pull your energy back and for you to pour what you have been pouring into other people into yourself. And although you do have this massive heart space, it's okay for you to pour into yourself. That's an act of self-love and self-preservation because you are your home. From divine muscular, type yes if you believe. 